This is my 2021 holiday haul. I'm looking for some sparkly dress up pieces that I can wear to Christmas events and a New Year's Eve party. This year I'm going to a New Year's Eve wedding so I'm looking specifically for a dress like that. So this is all glitz glam and we'll see what else I got. Dress the population, sparkly sequin. This specific wedding is going to be in Tahoe so I want to make sure that I'm warm. Part of me just wants to wear like boots and a fur jacket, but I have to dress up and it's going to be inside, so it's going to be totally fine. But I want something that's warm yet still festive and sequency. So this one I really like. It's just like totally glitz glam. It's bodycon. You can see all the black sparkle on it and the sequins and the little details of where the sequins sit. So this is sort of like a black mesh material sitting over a beige base and it's really warm. It's pretty long, but it still hugs you nicely. So I think this would be at just like my hair curled. Some black Louboutins will be gorgeous. I don't know if I'd wear a necklace with this. I'd probably just wear some like really pretty earrings and bracelets and rings, some cute shoes. And then the dress itself is already so sparkly, which I think is really gorgeous and beautiful. So they had this one in red too, but unfortunately they were sold out. So I got the black. I think the black is really beautiful. It's very New Year's Eve. So this is Yumi Kim in a size small, and it's called the Dory Dress. It's black velvet, super soft. I do think it's a slightly too big for me, so I would want to get a size smaller, but I think they were sold out, so that's probably not gonna work. Yeah, normally I'm not sure about the one sleeve look, but I think this could be kind of cool with like a chunky necklace maybe wearing your bracelets on the opposite hand with some cute like tights or maybe even thigh high boots. But yeah, I like that it's different. I like that it's velvet and it's soft. This one is probably more fun for Christmas versus New Year's. It already feels like I'm opening up presents for Christmas. So I needed a clutch for the wedding and I thought this was really cute. This is also black sparkle and it has gold handle that kind of looks like a bracelet. I think this will be really cute not only for the wedding, but for any special occasion. So it opens up with a zipper on the top, and then it's just kind of like a little pouch. So there's nothing inside to put your cards or anything. So you literally just like throw your phone, credit card, and whatever else you need with you. But it will hold all the essentials. So cute, then you zip it up, pop it down, and it's gonna be so pretty. Look how gorgeous that is. So this is called OW Intimates. So pretty, it's a silver sparkly skirt and it comes, well, I got it with the matching top and I just thought this would be so pretty for New Year's Eve. It's silver, so like with a nice tan, I think that would look really good. And then I have this really cool jacket I just got with more like glitz and glam, it's like a blazer. So it's kind of like mixing glam with sophistication. I even like just the skirt. You could just wear like a nice oversized sweater with it. You could maybe wear the silver cami with a high waist pant. So this is exactly what I thought it would be. It's a New Year's Eve party dress and you know what kind of party you would wear this to. So sparkly and silver. And yeah, my skin is super white right now, but I think with a tan, some pretty makeup, maybe strappy shoes, this would be gorgeous. But yeah, I do wanna try it on with the blazer. So let me go get that. So this is the blazer that I just got. I love all the details on it. It's Sink Acept. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that correctly. And it just has all this amazing embellishment. And then a cute little saying, speak up, inspire, and love. And then I love the detailing around the neck and the collar. It has this cute little slit. So yeah, I don't know about this top in particular, but I just kind of love this look. I like the idea of something sexier underneath, like something more sophisticated. I think that combination is kind of cool. Feminine and girly and fun while also refined. I don't think this is appropriate for a wedding, but if I was going to just a regular New Year's party, I'd probably wear this outfit. So last but not least, wow. This is Michael Costello's size small and it's a really beautifully beaded dress, black with gold beads on it. There's a zipper down the back and then these wide bell sleeves. So this one actually might be another option for the wedding, but this is just so stunning and it feels way nicer than it looks online. I'm actually really impressed 
by this. I thought it'd be a little less material, but this feels like it'd be really warm too, which is perfect because I need something warm. I love this. It's kind of extra with these sleeves and then it has this little slit. It's just gold beaded everywhere. It feels very good on the shoulder pads are definitely there, but it's not too extreme, but it's very flashy, very like over the top glitz glam. I think it's really sophisticated and beautiful and it just feels amazing. It's hard to decide which one I want to wear. It's kind of giving me a little bit more Tisha Gomez vibes actually. It's just all the extra black fabric hanging down. I almost forgot to show you. This is the black clutch and it kind of just blends in. You can't even really see it, which is awesome. It doesn't take away from the dress at all. So kind of a small New Year's haul. Let me know what you think about all the dresses, which one you like the best or which ones you don't like. Let me know what you're wearing this New Year's Eve and subscribe if you like fashion and beauty. I will see you next time.